Hello, I'm Mike Biardbark, and this is part four, the concluding part of my walkthrough for the Temple of Amun Ra. So let's continue. A useful tip for these guys is to run up to them and duck in front of them and then their shots go straight over your head. Right, that's one down, one to go. Same trick, duck, and about ten shots. Okay then, let's have a uh, checkpoint save. Now these guys are out of the way, it's uh, safe to try and pick up this medipack. Working out how to uh, advance through this room took me quite a while, but what we need to do is to go into this corner where they've got a slight raised pile of dirt and leap up onto the crack and shimmy along. Some of these jumps are a little bit fiddly, not difficult, just fiddly, so we'll do saves as we go. So from there to here, walking carefully forwards, and again we jump and grab over to here. We can't go anti-clockwise, so we'll have to go clockwise round. And over to here. Now this jump is a bit touchy. So, this is how you're meant to do it, but sometimes she doesn't quite make it. So around we go to the jump lever, which I missed. So reload and retry. And we'll have a quick save here so that, there we go, this should drop a rope down which will enable us to swing up to the pedestal there and grab the pyramid talisman. So we have to go round again. And here we go. Just as before. However, before we go for the rope, let's go and get the last secret of this level. If we look behind us, we can see that there's a crack in this wall. So over we go and shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. And the final secret. Shotgun, shells and oozy clips. So there we are. Eight secrets out of eight. So for the third time, let's shimmy over and jump the pillars.
and around. And this time, instead of leaping all the way over, we just want to grab the rope. Make sure you're lined up square, because otherwise you might not make the jump. It's a pretty long jump. We'll save on the rope. And just keep uh, pumping. Hold the sprint key down for about three swings and jump and here we are the pyramid talisman so I guess you know where we need to go now back to the pyramid area So out of here. Back out into the valley. to the pyramid face. Remembering not to fall in the spike trench. That would be silly, wouldn't it? Oh well, I chose the wrong square to jump on. But uh, it's just a case of finding the slightly shallower squares and zigzagging the way up difficult to see sometimes which squares are which there are two beetles around here didn't quite make that one. So let's blast the buggers when they turn up. Oh dear! Better, there he is. Let's blast the bugger. I thought we saw a beetle rise. Then Mike. There's gonna be one on the top of here though. got it wrong again See, there's another one over there. We'll preempt it.
Well, we'll grab the oozing clips and we won't we'll miss. Have to do it again. Bloody annoying the way tiny little positional missteps make you slide all the way back down to the bottom. Now then. Take it step by step. <laughs> Not that we'll need much more ammo, but Uzi clips here. And over in one of these, fortunately didn't go too far down, is some Desert Eagle clips. We've got two more monsters left in this level, two more demigods, so the uh, Desert Eagle clips will come in very handy. Now apply the Pyramid Talisman. And the gates to the Pyramid open. Now we want to slide down, but make sure we don't slide into the pit, or that will be instant death. So we'll go this way. We don't really need it, but let's have a health pack. Now there is a <coughs> difficult to see spike trap just down here, which I found. So around we go. And around. I think there's going to be the uh, two creatures in here. Starting over this side. Whoops, starting over the other side. The other one activates. Ten shots for you. And this guy drops the serpent key. Which goes into this little receptacle back here. As far as I remember, there's no pickups or shootable objects. So put this in there. Gate opens the other side. run through the passages. Now we have a very long ladder to climb, just in case we fall off. Up and up and up and up we go. She finally makes it to the top. This is a nice looking area. If we look back down, we can see a little shelf with two of the cat statues on it. 
We could have uh, got to there, but there's nothing on it, so there's no real point. And there's nothing in this water area either. So we go and have a swim round if you like. Absolutely nothing in the way of goodies or pickups. Well, we need to go to the central platform here. Nothing special, just swim over and climb up. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is the end of the level. We have all eight secrets. I succumbed and used a few health packs. And Thank you all for watching and thank you to Agent XP for a wonderful level. That's it then. Goodbye.